Hey guys, Daniel here. Uh, I'm just going to do a video covering uh, setting up your uh, C name DNS uh, record in your in Namecheap. Uh, if you're using ClickMagic, uh, you've known over the last couple of days uh, they've we've gone away from method one, uh, method two. And they're recommending this new method three using the C name DNS uh, with the redirect. So and a and a few problem uh, people have having uh, a few issues setting it up. So I'm just going to give a quick basic overview uh, just to help help a few of the guys out uh, to sort it out um, so they can get uh, keep moving on uh, with their with their steps or their business. There's just a quick run through. So as you see, this is Click Magic here, the domain manager. And in the FAQs, they do recommend um, uh, how you set up your custom domain. They're using GoDaddy or Namecheap, whichever domain registrar you're using. Um, they do have some instructions here, but uh, if you're not familiar with uh, or comfortable with when you see names in A records then you probably come into a few issues so I'm just going to go over it very quickly to uh, help you guys out uh, in any way I can so yeah, I'm just using a dummy domain here uh, old domain just to show you as, as you see at present uh, the C name record is the, at the, the default the parking page dot namecheat.com and here is my just a dummy uh, existing uh, old URL redirect record which is to recreate some mask and so forth so I'm going to show you all you have to do is change these particular two to the new settings that um, click magic has uh, given you so for the first one you can put it leave it as C record if, and the www but we're going to change this to let me see you're going to change it to this here the WW uh, and this one is for rotators if you're setting up a rotator uh, for your team but uh, we're going to use this one here so you just copy this then you go back over to your name tube just check that in there and I set this for one minute on the TTL just so it recognizes it faster so and then you're going to change the URL record URL redirect record you're going to change that to an A record and you're going to have the at symbol here because this is going to help you with the www uh, dot whatever domain name you have and then you're going to have that helps out as well so it recognizes the www and then it recognizes the uh, the, the root domain if you don't have the www so that actually helps with both of them so we can just change it to a minute and this is what you're going to have in here this is actually the IP address and the IP address you're going to put is they have a couple down here as you scroll down so you can use either one of these two so I'm just going to use the first one here you copy that IP address you chuck it in here paste that into there confirm save your changes and I'll just do a quick refresh So that will take a minute or so, a minute to two minutes, you leave that, so it actually recognises or propagates uh, your new settings that you've actually just put in there. And after that we're going to chuck it into ClickMagic, add it to our domain manager and see how that turns out. If it actually already propagates, um, it should recognise it straight away. So really, 
all you're doing is just updating these two records um, in whatever domain registrar that you're using uh, just keep it simple and then when we go back over to so you just want to copy the root domain here whichever one you're using you can just copy there or type it to the sure that you're comfortable with and you go back to the domain manager you just copy that into there and you keep that the C name DNS tracking links and you want to cloak this with the domain say no and you're just going to add the custom domain and as you see here it is ecom100k.com and it's already been added to there so that's just a quick uh, overview and hopefully this helps you guys setting up your custom domain uh, with the new method that they suggest in ClickMagic. So hopefully that helps you out and gets you, gets you on your way and uh, doesn't hold you back from tracking your links. So this is Daniel signing off. Thanks for watching and hopefully this helps you guys out. Thank you. Catch you later.